Here we have a Latitude D620 notebook. This is one of Dell's business range notebooks, still one of their most popular because uh, of its robustness. We'll have a look at changing the hard drive of this notebook, again across most of the Latitude and Inspiron ranges. Changing the hard drive is a very simple and similar procedure, so although I'm using this as the test laptop, it's very similar with most Dell notebooks on the market today. So if we turn over the laptop, on the underside we can see obviously you've got your, your docking port there, you've got your cover for your extra RAM, we'll cover adding extra RAM into the system in a, a separate video. Uh, we've got the battery and we've got the area here which is where the hard drive is stored. I know that's where the hard drive is because usually you get strike zone written underneath the laptop. You also got little cylinder shapes next to the screws. Um, always best to start with removing the laptop from any external power source as well as removing the battery. So I'm just going to remove the battery. Right, once you remove the battery, remember whenever working with components and opening up systems, always ground yourself or wear an anti-static wristband. Uh, I've not got a wristband on but I've already ground myself, so by touching something m metal, uh, so not something like a radiator which is painted, but something that's just bare metal. So as we can see, the two screws here, they've got a, a cylinder shape next to each screw. So we're going to remove these two screws. Once you remove them two screws, that's really all there is to it. You just slide the laptop out, uh, sorry, the hard drive out of the laptop, and there we go, there's there's your hard drive. Now the hard drive is usually in some sort of a caddy. If you lock across the edges of the hard drive, that's where you usually find that it's screwed into the caddy. With this one, we can see that there's one screw just there, and that, that's the only part of the caddy there. It just, it just takes the edge off. Uh, you can then replace that with a brand new hard drive and then simply reverse the procedure slide the hard drive back into your notebook put the two screws back into place remember to put your battery back into place and that's about it also remember that you've obviously got to install your operating system and device drivers from scratch uh, and that's changing your hard drive on most Inspiron and Latitude notebooks